Clear to land, 6 Delta Kilo. Timberman Tower, Cessna 277, Golf Tango holding short, 4 left. Cessna 277, Golf Tango, Timberman Tower, Roger, hold short, runway 4 left, Skyline traffic, left base. Holding short, 4 left, for Skyline traffic, 277, Golf Tango. It does. So initially you're holding short. If he tells you to hold short, you have to repeat back hold short. Okay. You would be holding short, you'd be hold short. Okay. Don't ask. I think I've yelled at that by tower so many times. <laughs> they're like, yeah, holding short. And they're like, no, hold short. I'm like, holding short? They're like, hold short. Hold short. Thank you. Alright. Yeah. I guess, I mean, it's pretty critical that you don't go doing runway incursions, but... Not taking off when a plane is landing. It'd make for an epic YouTube video. Yeah, you can do it on your solo. Just not, uh, <laughs> not with me. I'm good. <laughs> make sure somebody else signs off your solo, too. Formation flying on the runway. Can be done. Oh, there he is. Oh, this might be a cool clip, you think? Oh. No. No. <laughs> He's on. I was on see if Oh, you're not gonna get the landing mission. See, it just fly by. Well, we'll we'll throw the 360 out that way. Oh yeah, I guess the wing's gonna be blocking it. Good landing. Good landing. Eight out of ten. <laughs> Nice and smooth. Pitch for 74. Ah, what are your landing spots? Probably that road right there. Why would you like better? The road? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there isn't much because we got all these power lines you try to keep going forward. Yeah. I mean, right there, you're definitely going to be nicking some signs, maybe a fence, a tree, light pole, something. Something. Maybe a schoolyard. Granted, there's no kids running around outside, that might be an idea. Imagine that you're at recess and a plane comes and lands on everybody. <laughs> Good visibility morning, huh? Yeah, a little hazy. Cessna 7, Golf Tango, runway 4 left, clear for the option. 4 left, clear for the option, 7, Golf Tango. Right. 
our 90 degrees of beam, we will do throttle 1500, flaps 10. Uh, we will pitch for 80, catch 80. Maybe we have full in this one. Or do we make this turn over the rail yard? Dude, about 45 degrees from uh, the runway. Do we make this turn with a different runway? Huh? Do we make this, do we turn over the rail yard in a different runway? I don't know. Oh, okay. You're not going to have a railroad yard at every airport. Oh, no, I'm just trying to figure out if I uh, have flown four left before. All right. Treat like a new airport. Yeah. Now you can be using all your land references, but in the long run, is that going to help you? Nope. Nope. Pitch 70. Okay, really pitch 70. We'll give her a little throttle. Remember, we're just going to be patient in ground effect. Slow smooth on the controls with a no wind, light wind day. Right, 70 until short final, pretty, pretty much wants to get over the airport itself. We'll get to like 65, we can land anywhere between like 60, 62, 65-ish. Okay. That'll minimize the amount of ground effect, the time we take there, because we're at a very low airspeed. Let's be patient and don't slam the nose gear. That's all I ask. Stay on the runway, stay on the runway, stay on the runway. Okay. Yeah, yeah we drifted. Really yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. All right. Flaps up. Throttle 1500. Oh. Just rotate. Just rotate. <laughs> are we going to push a little bit? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what did we do when we were getting pushed? <laughs> right, Aileron. You did nothing. You just. Oh, well, yeah, I did nothing. Yes. What should I have done? Yeah. I know you know what to do. You just got to do it. Yeah. Uh, don't be afraid to have some fun in the controls. Like, if you want to try being a little bit more aggressive one time, just be in the back of your mind that, hey, we're probably going to go around. I just want to try to see how this feels. Okay. Right? See what it takes to give me that left side slip or right side slip back over. left clear for the option 7 gold tango. Alright, throttle 1500, flaps 10, pitch 80. Catch 80.
Alright. Flaps 20. Pitch 70, catch 70. Found out to get below 70 new turns. Line off the runway, yep. Okay. We can do a touch and go here. Throttle up, or flaps up, throttle 1500. Rotate. Not bad. A little delayed on your right aileron, but I saw you try to use it. Yeah. Alright. That one. Yeah, yeah, fast. Uh, I mean, round out's good. Yeah, it's felt like uh, it floated a little bit when I, I think just because like, we were coming in so fast. Yep, higher uh, speed. Okay. Right. Need about 75, like, maybe like 100 feet off the ground. So when you got in the ground, in fact, you're about 70, you had a bleed off about you know, 15 knots. Not bad, I just want you to control it in ground effect, right? We're not, the plane's not safe until we're on, down on the ground and it's turned off. Yep. Just got blown to the left twice. Yeah, so. so you can kind of assume that, hey, maybe when we're in ground effect next time, we might want to put in, you know, <laughs> this is straight. Maybe just putting in like that much. Yeah. Okay. Right, not enough to where we're going to flip over, but enough to preemptively see what that'll do. Cessna 7, Golf Tango, runway 4 left, clear for the option. 4 left, clear for the option, 7, Golf Tango. Increase beam, throttle 1500, flaps 10, catch 80, catch 80. Some 20 degree flaps.
All right. Turn final. 30 degree flaps. Have I been, did I do 30 degree flaps the last two times? Who knows? Let's keep her coming down. Look at the wind, Doc. What's it telling you? A little bit to the uh, winds out of the right. That's probably a 60 degree crosswind. But also guess the velocity, so it's maybe around like five knots ish. So they're more than likely going to be needing a little bit of corrections in there. Complete cross. Yep. Great knob. Money. Right. Crosswind, crosswind, crosswind. Crosswind correction. Yep. Flaps up. Bottle full. Red letter. Red letter. Rotate. Did it take a lot of uh, correction? No, no. Not much at all. But you had the ailerons in. Dip the wing and it was just enough to keep you straight. That was perfect. Let's try to get you to land like where you should now instead of landing long. <laughs> All right. I just hate coming down so steep when it like at the edge of the runway, but I think that I mean that's just what I the feeling I need to develop. Right. Well, get the crossings down. Let's figure out your aiming point. I want you to tell me what your aiming point is every time you're rolling on a final. <coughs> Definition aiming point is? The part on the windscreen that I'm trying to hit here on the numbers. Yeah. Yep. Trying to keep the, this point at the same exact spot on your windscreen. And if you don't round out, you don't flare, then you're going to smash the prop right at that point. You seem kind of quiet this morning. You doing all right? Yeah. Sleepy. Okay. okay. Weather sucks. <laughs> but at least we're flying. We're finally flying. Yeah. Four canceled lessons in a row. That's four? <laughs> yeah. I've been booking like... Cessna 7 Golf Tango, runway four left, clear for the option. Four left, clear for the option, 7 Golf Tango. I've been booking like every day. I uh, know, this week I've been feeling like absolute garbage. <laughs> yeah. All right, throttle 1500, flaps 10. Yeah, are you feeling any better? I yeah. guess you said you worked out yesterday. Worked out yesterday, it was good. I like stomach issues, man. Oh, that's, that's the last thing I'm gonna do is sit in a plane for two hours where there's no bathroom and like... Yeah, when you gotta throw out top of the window, especially uh, one of those gusty days. I had to throw up, like I wasn't like feverish, it was just kinda like... The, the, the diarrhea? Kind of sad, just like my stomach, just, <laughs> dude. I think that's going around. Like I ate like a fucking carcass off the side of the road, and it's just, <laughs> just wrecking havoc. Now one of our line guys is sick right now too. I know a couple people already have the flu now. That new new virus. Oh, the Omicron or Megatron. The Optimus, Optimus Prime. Optimus Prime account. Beat you to it. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I was uh, texting, had an intro flight, and he canceled today due to the uh, weather. I'm like, yeah, well, Monday's looking pretty optimistic. Guess what my phone decided to uh, switch my word uh, optimistic uh, to. To Optimus Prime? Yeah. yeah oh. So, Monday's looking pretty Optimus Prime. <laughs> like, dude, I've never once texted Optimus Prime. Why, where are you getting this from, man? I, I think my spelling was that bad. Yeah, let's let's change the point. Yeah, well, it's not good right now. Let me get. What uh, is it? What do you want it to be? The numbers. Numbers. And I want it. Why not make it the base of the L? Okay, base of the L, right here. Cool. There we go. All right, now All we're right. managing our airspeed and altitude. So yeah. yep, good. Reduce that power even more. All right, 
pitch for po airspeed, power for altitude, right? It's kind of a combination of everything once we get here. Because we pitch to make our aiming point, we're going to increase airspeed, right? So that'd pretty much be like idle now, right? So if you were to pitch down at 70 knots, you're just going to gain airspeed. And we're holding about 65 right now. But it's about 30, 40 off, 50 ish. Good, right? 62 knots. Too much, yep. Yeah. Nice. Look like shit the last hundred feet, but that came in nice. Laps up. Not a fall. Rotate. Yeah, too much. Too much. Okay. Well, you yeah. made corrections, right? No, it's moving. Kind of all the runway. Yeah, I mean, you made it back. Yeah. You're able to control the aircraft, right? You didn't really use left tailor on. You knew the wind would kind of push you over, which is nice. What a random ass dog? Dog? Oh, it is, yeah. I saw a dog taking a shit in the field, and there's like nobody standing around him. I'm like, is that just a random. Uh, that's the part of town you're in. Uh. Yeah, that hit and run right on final. That guy's been there since uh, 9 30, 9 40. Wait, what time is it right now? 10 40. Uh, this is there since like 8 o'clock then. Sorry, what? They've been there since 8 o'clock. Oh, I didn't see it. like hop, and there's like a car facing the wrong way in the road. Oh, right. I guess it's a hit and run, and that, they've just been hanging out there for like two hours now. Yep, good job on your aiming point, right? Even though we have our aiming point, we still have to look for runway expansion. You didn't really know when to round out there. Did you? I guess... You rounded out way too early. No, I did. So I okay. just, we were up really high, we cut over, we're trying to come back. Tango runway 4 left, clear for the option. 4 left, clear for the option, Tango. Okay. 9 degrees of beam, we'll do. Bottle 1500, flaps 10, catch 80, pitch 80. Flaps. Pitch 70, pitch 70. That's oh. straight level set picture. We're going to continue bleeding off airspeed if you don't lower the nose. Are you flying away from the runway or to the runway? What? Oh, you think we're. That was a little bit. Okay. Aiming point base of the L. That's where you're looking kind of high for that. There you go. Yeah, it's starting to feel some of that wind. There's the cap down there. Oh, okay, I gotcha. Yep, what do you think about power right now? Airspeed is about 69. Nice. Ooh. All right, flaps.
Caps up. Throttle full. Rotate. Okay, so did I just not flare enough at the end? Just flat, flat landing, yep. Okay. Are you controlling in ground fight, which is good? I mean, the lines are looking consistently good. The only thing I worry about is if you do go up still on a cross one day and you just get blown off and you don't either, you don't go around, you don't correct for it, and you just think, hey, if I land on like this last little eighth of the runway, I'm totally going to be fine. Yeah. Especially to the left where you added full power and again, and then you go even more left. Yeah. Yeah. Other than that, I mean, traffic pattern is flawless, man. Like, really good. Are you working all weekend or you got big plans for your weekend? Weather depending, hopefully working. <laughs> Nothing planned. I go shooting and drinking tomorrow. Shooting then drinking, sorry. <laughs> Is there a range around here? Where'd you go? McMiller and Eagle. Like, 45 minute drive, but... Cessna 7 Golf Tango, runway 4 left, clear for the option. 4 left, clear for the option, 7 Golf Tango. They have a little, like, shotgun to pit. They have 100, 200, 300 yard ranges. They have, uh, shooting clays. Nice. But it's all outdoors, right? How do you survive? Like, I'll put a thermal on under all this. <laughs> Marshmallow man out there with a shotgun. Couple of shots of Jack, you know, warm me up from the inside. Jack is to warm me up from the outside. Do, do I need to cut that part out? Well, it's clearly a joke. Oh, shooting okay. and driving is bad. Oh, shooting and drinking is bad. <laughs> driving uh, drive by is also bad. Oh, man. Shooting and driving, popular in Milwaukee. Very popular. Frowned upon. But frowned upon, yeah. Okay. There we go. Well, it's in Chicago, degrees. and it's claimed mutual gang violence, and it's totally okay. <laughs> That's such a crazy thing. A couple hundred shots popped off. Ah, it's just mutual gang violence. You guys are yeah. fine, right? Cool? Cool? Alright, yeah, no charges. Yeah. That would make, like, a great reality TV show. This week on Gang Wars! <laughs> yeah. Oh, John brings down. out his solar ray. <laughs> Brought the corneas of all the other gang members. Considered fair in uh, <laughs> Gang War, season 16. Alright. 30 degree flaps. Pitch down. Were we cleared? Yeah. Okay. German Tower 7 Golf Tango requesting on the go northbound departure. German Tower 7 Golf Tango on the go northbound departure approved. On the go northbound 7 Golf Tango. Control the aircraft. All right, got it. Then we can go. All right, <laughs> immediately. Sixty-five. Let's give it a second. Yep. Then we're losing lift right. as we do it. Start pitching up a little bit more. Our right. obstacles. Make sure we're at a safe altitude before we go to zero. All right, sixty-five positive rate of climb. At a safe altitude. 
Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, we can climb with full blast, full power. Oh no, a plane just crashed at the runway. The airport's closed. What are we going to do? At that? Yeah. Let's go land somewhere else? Yeah, where are you going to go? Uh, I think you wanted to go north, so I suppose we're going to West Bend. Where did you go? Well, I'd probably go to Waukesha since it's closer, but... Let's just start heading north. Let me know what Waukesha weather is and if we could land there. Okay. Well... My controls. Your controls. Grab yeah. your iPad. Yeah. Belt's on. Big day tonight? What? Yeah. Big day tonight? Well, you gotta make a joke about taking it off with your teeth. I, didn't, <laughs> I, was, I was trying to make a new joke this time. I said, big day tonight, that's it. you, by the way. I'm not doing all your turn for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Rain alert. Alright, where are we going? Well, Garmin says we're going to hit something. Well, we can just go to West Bend. They have an FBO there. They got hot coffee. They got free waters. Oh my god. They have a Spring City there. Alright. And lately, how high can we be right now? We can be 3,500. Yeah, with the clouds. What? With the clouds. Oh. We can only be. 500 feet below, if they're at uh, 1,500, so we can be 1,000, so like 1,800, so yeah, we cannot be this high. Right at the border. for a second? My or, controls. And your controls. Oh my goodness. It would be helpful if I learned how to use this software. Probably. You're going to rely on it for your solo? Yeah. Me, I got controls. Your controls. Always have them. It's drifting like crazy. I don't think there's this much wind up here. Alright, Waukesha. You tell me. Well, I want to go to West Bend. Let's go to West Bend then. Okay. I'm just offering Waukesha because they have a nice FBO to hang out at. They have a Spring City there, so we can always like Uber back, worst case. That's better to be a further Uber. Nothing to do aviation related, just kind of like easier. And I was flying back into that thunderstorm, I just dropped it. 
uh, Waukesha left the plane there. Alright. We can see AWAS. 120 points. Your controls. My controls. We are not flying towards West Bend. Are we ready to go to West Bend? Thousand seven hundred overcast temperature one Celsius two point minus one altimeter two niner niner three two niner niner three yep West Bend Municipal Airport automated weather observation one six five eight Zulu weather wind zero seven zero at five visibility one zero Ceiling 1,700. Overcast temperature 1 Celsius. Dew point minus 1 altimeter 2 niner niner 3. Got it all? No. Got none of it. Something at West Bend Municipal Airport. Automated weather observation 1658 Zulu weather wind 080 at 5 visibility 10 ceiling 1700 overcast temperature 1 Celsius 2 point minus the rates are at 5. Okay. What are the clouds at? 1600 overcast 17. Overcast 17. Zero. Cool. Seven. All right, altimeter setting we already put in. All right. Okay, so we'll land at runway six. Um. West Bend. And. Do you cruise checklist yet? Cruise checklist, follow cruise RPM, trim adjust. Heading verify. Well, we are not going towards West Bend. We'll start flying towards West Bend. Mixture lean. Oh, fuel quantity check. Yep. Engine instruments. Green, 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 green. Good. Slide instruments. Yep, good, good. Vertical speed, we're climbing a little bit. Okay. 33. Okay. We'll plug our runway, which is 6. says Bravo Jewel. Oh, there it just changed. Never mind. We're good. Come on, you piece of shit. Frequency. BTAF 122.8. You do your whole pro checklist? Approach checklist, ATIS weather check, comm radio set, yep, nav radios set, we won't use that one, okay. Do you not know where West Bend is? No, I know where West Bend is, but I want the distance. Never mind. Alright. Um, West Bend, 04 south, departing runway 6, thank the pattern, West Bend.
Do you see the airport? Yes. Cool. Make sure you get your whole checklist done, right? I would have recommended not going right to West Bend until we were ready. Okay. Mr. Rich, feel like they're both approach briefing. Um, we're going to land on runway six. It is long enough. Um, traffic we're pattern at, altitude. Uh, we are at traffic pattern altitude. Traffic, 5 one over Mercalf, left cross wind, runway nine. Why let people know where we are, because yeah. I can't see shit and we're at traffic pattern altitude in the pattern. West Bend traffic, Cessna 277, Golf Tango, five miles to the south for right base, runway 06. West Bend traffic. West Bend traffic. Yeah. Five miles is kind of a lot. I would have said maybe like three and a half, four. Okay. There was a guy who said he was taken off on. Yep, staying in the pattern. Okay. Yep, we are 2.2 miles away. Hot log. Oh yeah, we're a little close to that runway. You know what I mean about why'd you go directly to West Bend? West Bend traffic zero four hotel turning crosswind runway six West Bend. Yeah, just because I could have saved some time and. Yeah, I would have waited to go directly there because we were only like seven miles away. You had nothing prepared, prepared yeah. or planned. Yep. That's traffic a, five, two, one, there's no emergency that we had to get down right away. If you're soloing, there's yeah. no like Roger. I need to get here, right? You can go circle around if you want. You can go fly over to the lake for all I care. As yeah. long as you stay within the area that we're at and you're prepared to come to each place. Oh, I can fly over the lake? We'll talk about that. <laughs> Turkeys! No factor. They're on the... They're just walking in a little tribe. Okay, that's 30 degree flaps. We're coming in high. You don't need a massy... Traffic Cessna 277 Gulf Tango turning final. Runway 06. What are your intentions? No. Yeah, let them know what your intentions are. Don't worry about it now. Very good. Well, keep her coming down. Westman traffic 04 hotel on downwind runway 6. We'll do another lap in the pattern or two. Up. Throttle full, right rudder, right rudder, rotate. Yeah, good job being patient in the ground effects. That's good. To let them know now what? Well, that we're flying. We're clear of runway six. Cessna 277, Gulf Tango, clear of runway six, or left than traffic. Turning left, bit, or left cross one. I was going to continue talking to help you not sound like an idiot. But you know, let him know that you're clear of runway 6 staying in the pattern. Okay. That'd have sounded way, way better, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Nailed it. That is cleared runway 6 or something on the left face all of a sudden. Flying backwards. Big headwind. I said, I said left car. I fixed it, right? So, who knows? He's got no reply from that guy. He's like, you know what? I'm just gonna go to Hartford. It's a lot safer at Hartford than having <laughs> you here. <laughs> Golf traffic, five two one November Golf, turning cross one. Through zero. Golf. Golf. Which one is that? Or which? 
Report that. Not westbound. Right. Hey, is uh, westbound left or right traffic? I should have looked. No. Oh. It is left traffic, I checked. Okay. But again, something in your approach briefing to think yeah. about. Westbound traffic, Cessna 277 Gulf Tango, turning left downwind. Westbound traffic. And Westbound traffic, 7 Gulf Tango has traffic to follow inside Westbound traffic. 10 o'clock, final. Oh, okay. Gulf traffic, 521 November Gulf, turning downwind, runway 09 Gulf. 1500, 10 degree flaps. Do you have the uh, ADSB on there? On here? Yeah. Yeah. Westbound traffic, Cessna 277, Gulf Tango, turning left base, runway 06, westbound. Gulf traffic, 521, November Gulf, turning base, runway 09. Westbound 04, hotel, upwind, runway 6, westbound. Westbound traffic, Cessna 277, Gulf Tango, turning final, runway 6, westbound. Behold 70 here. I don't want you getting slow on finals. Got a good habit of being slow. Flaps up, throttle full. No crosswinds, you land fine. Don't know what the hell happened to your center line there, but we'll. Right, right, uh, what do you want to do? I'll do another lap here. Yeah, your landings look good with no crosswinds. Westbound traffic, Cessna 277, Gulf Tango, clear, runway 06, westbound. Staying in the pattern. Staying in the pattern. Traffic, Cessna 277, Gulf Tango, turning left, crosswind, runway 06, west left. Three, huh? two, one. Whee! Oh boy. Broke 90 knots. Wait, what? You're over 90 knots. You see traffic ahead? Oh. Okay. And, sorry, what is the roll with 90 knots? If I see you climbing out above 90 knots for a while, I count down to three. And then, uh, you know, if you haven't realized that, hey, maybe you're not climbing at VY, then I'm just going to pull aggressively up. Okay. Where I haven't done that to you yet? No, not once. Go to try to follow in sight. What's the call? Do you have the traffic to Yes. Yeah. yeah. Don't need to call anything. Okay. One November Golf turning crosswind, runway zero nine Golf. Westman zero four hotel turning the base for runway six Westman. Okay. So we'll extend our downwind then. Yeah, but we are 
way far out. Was he just flying a really wide pattern? Could be a slower aircraft, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, no, he was really far out. <laughs> Golf traffic, 521 November Golf, turning downwind runway 09 Golf. Yep, so again, when you get to final, um, let him know your intentions on the go. How did I just lose him? Oh, there he is. Okay. So, we'll cross him. Then we'll go. One, two, three. Westbound traffic, Cessna 277, Golf Tango, turning left race, runway 06, westbound. Alright, so what are we going to be doing after this? We're going back to Thurman. Yep, so what do you be telling them? South departure. Sure. Okay. Oh, we are way out here in the boonies, aren't we? Oh, fuck. Yep. Yeah. Golf traffic, 5 to 1, November Golf, turning base, runway to zero, 09 Golf. How can we decrease our distance to the runway? By cutting her. Oh. Makes sense, right? Yeah. Something you can do when you're low. Or you're following a goober like this guy. He's going to watch this video, and he's going to be upset that you call him a goober. If you don't want to be called a goober, don't act like a goober. <laughs> Simple. Traffic system 277 Gulf Tango turning final runway 06 westbound. But right, again, right there, you could have said your intentions there. Okay. Do you ever talk directly to them? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. We just went down to East Troy and. There's a guy saying he was coming in from four miles. We're like, hey, yeah, we're six miles to the north east, northwest. He's coming in from the southeast. It's like, hey, traffic uh, to the north. How's the how's it looking up there? So visually, I can see he zero four hotel clear R one right westbound. Okay, I can see visually yep. that he cleared it. But... Yeah, but his call also matters. Okay. You grease it today too. All right. Take control of the aircraft. Yep. Stay on the runway, center line. Yeah, yeah buddy. Rotate. Yeah, we got another greaser. West Bend traffic, Cessna 277, Gulf Tango, departing to the south. West Bend. Yeah, so people can talk to each other. He was asking how the what the cloud coverage, cloud coverage, yikes, was up there. To let them know, and then, you know, once we both came in at the same time, we're like, Hi, we see you, uh, we'll follow you right behind you, number two for the runway. Oh, okay, you're saying the guy you were talking to in yeah. Troy? Where the hell is Troy? East Troy. Uh, south, west of Timberman. How do I enter? Press the enter button. Enter. But, I mean, they're just people out there, right? On tower, it doesn't have to be extremely professional, right? They're just people, man. They're just people. Oh, the people get freaked out over talking to the tower like they're fucking robots and you're gonna get a slap of the wrist every time you see something wrong, but it generally can be like, hey, uh, I'm over um, at the FBL, I'd like to kind of taxi on over and we'll be kind of going this way. You can sound like an idiot, right? Golf oh, traffic, 5 to 1 November Golf, turning crosswind, runway 09 Golf. I highly recommend putting your sectional map on there. Rather than the terrain map, but it's just my opinion. Yep. Hey, uh, what are the cloud covers at? Ooh. How high can we go today? We can go to 1800. Good thing we never went above 1800. Good thing. Yeah. All right. Those are clouds, man. 
Yeah, you can fly in them. You can fly in them. Turning downwind. Legally, yeah, eight, but for nine. the safety, well, I can't legally in this aircraft with the icing. Oh, okay. Flying it to knowing icing conditions is prohibited. It says somewhere in here. Okay. Well, uh, that was fun. Yeah. Well, uh, pay better attention. I figure instead of just telling you a little bit more dramatic flair is uh, going to help yeah. you not do it again. Not direct to... No. Oh, bingo. Golf traffic, 521 November Golf, turning crosswind, runway 09 Golf. I feel like we're at a nice cruising altitude. Oh, what do you, what do you mean? <laughs> All right, cruise checklist, throttle, cruise RPMs. He's good, he's okay. good. I think okay. reading my mind. Yeah, I'm dropping a little bit. Throttle, cruise RPMs. Are we legal to fly this low? What's that? Are we legal to fly this low? Um, yes, because it is not a... What defines a congested and non congested area? Uh, we do? Let, let me know if that's uh, stated anywhere. What is a congested and non congested? Yeah. Here's at home over some fucking farm fields. It's not okay. congested. I mean, very high <laughs> mixture lean, fuel quantity, good. Engine instruments. Very good. Hotel green. departing runway 6 westbound. Very good. Um. Are we, uh, what do you want to do once we get back to Timberman? Close traffic? A couple laps there, yeah. Should have time. Four one one zero Romeo, uh, about 18 miles to the east. Uh, just want to come in, do a touch and go. Uh, four one one zero Romeo. Okay. All right, pitch for 68, one, two, three. We have to do this every time. All right, uh, best place. How much do you have? Not a lot. I like that field. Yeah, we're going to make it? Yeah. Making that for sure. All right. Um, airspeed. B, best place to land. C, checklist. Fuel selector, both. Uh, cut off in. Mixture, rich. Throttle. You want me to try it? Doesn't work. Doesn't work. All right. Um, check the mags. Or fuel pump on, check the mags, doesn't work. Um, yeah, we're making this easy. Or about the power lines. Except we're uh, landing cross. We'll, uh... We're making it? Yeah, we're making it. Except we're gonna land cross against the field. Still a couple uh, power lines and stuff up there. Yeah, I mean, all right, all right, you made it. All right, but I guess we would have wanted to land with the... Uh... I don't care about that, we made it safe, so... Okay. What did I do there? Your controls again. My controls. I put you in a place where there were just trees ahead in the field directly off our left. Oh, so there was a easier place to Oh, land. way easier. Okay. I wanted you to fall for this trap, but... Apparently, you made it work. All right. Uh, Right, smarter ideas, right? There's all trees up here, right? And I pulled your power. Let's not aim for the field out there, but dude, look right over here, right? Okay. But do you just circle or what? Because you're way yeah. high. Okay. You can, the like the easiest thing is we, we plan for like traffic patterns. Right, so if we're like a beam to a, a field, we can just do a power off 180. Okay. Like we would in the, in the field where we practice. All right. We got pretty low on that one. What's that? We got pretty low on that one. I didn't think you'd make it. That's why I wanted to see what would happen. <laughs> I think I got an eye for that, because I did pretty well on the... You're bullshitting me. The, the, the fucking whatever, the uh, complete engine failure... Uh, oh, 180s are fine, yeah. But that was stretching it, man. Alright, we're less than 15 nautical miles. Okay, alright, yeah. Airport one two two field here. Um, we don't need to call in twelve miles up. We should probably do some other stuff. 
Oh, like our approach checklist? Yeah, need us weather. Whiskey. War or whiskey. Can I not turn off COM 1? Unless you go COM 2, but they need to be transmitting in COM 2. Is that the easiest way to do it? Turn on the volume. setting. Oh, it's the uh, idea or normal. Standard atmospheric pressure. Standard atmospheric pressure. All right. Where, so where are these tank farms that you like to call out? How about the big tank farms out there? The only thing oh. that we can really see around here. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so what about the rest of your checklist, though? Oh, that'd be fun. No. Too. All right. Nav radios. Yep. Set flight instruments. Good, good, Freaking good. Freaking mansion down there, dude. Holy Christ. Adjusting. My two cents. Oh my goodness, we're floating all over the place. Okay. That'll be good enough. Remember the Unos? Undershoot north, overshoot south, right? Due to compass delay. Yeah. I just watched that in the cool. 40s. But. Okay. Thank you. You don't need to save the tank farms too if you have other sources. You can tell them exactly where you are. Okay. Two seven seven Golf Tango, Tim Terry up. Two seven seven Golf Tango, eight miles to the north for touch and goes. Two seven seven Golf Tango, Roger. Uh, reporting two mile final runway one five left. Adis Whiskey is current. Advise when you have that. I do have a VFR target just east of your position, about two two and a half miles, two thousand Cessna circling. We have whiskey, we'll report two mile uh, final, 277, go pick up. I'll look for me and focus on your flight. Make sure your approach checklist is done. Okay. Fuel selector bolt, approach briefing, um, we're going to land runway 15 left, um, or 15 right. You tell me. <laughs> Whatever the concrete one is, we're going to land on. Um, 2000? Alright. You fly. Oh, east is that way, by the way. Oh. Huh, that makes sense. Yeah. Yikes. You're about flight, I'll look for the traffic. Did you do your approach briefing? Um, runway is long enough. We are going to start descent, or we're not going to start descending until we're, I mean, we are at traffic pattern altitude right now, a little low. Um, so we'll start configuring three miles out of the uh, CarMax. No, there's not a fucking CarMax at every airport. <laughs> seatbelts adjusted, or seats adjusted, seatbelts, lights as required. Yeah. Go to West Bend. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait for the car, the CarMax. Why is there no CarMax at this airport? I can't land. Why not like 2.5 nautical miles on the GPS? Why not look for the uh, glide slope indicators? Yeah, we can do that. Let's, uh, oh, there's the airport. Let's, yeah, come over here. Like we're actually gonna land on. Yeah. Runway 1-5 might be. Yeah, you know, like you told us come in on a final and then we just continue east towards the traffic. Yeah. That, that might not be good. <laughs> I can blame visibility for this one. Hey. Those are the tank farms. They grow up there. They grow tanks? 
Then they farm them. Oh. Yeah, not the pink cluster or the nope. water treatment plant. Water treatment plant, okay. Okay, bud. This are big words over here. Tank farm. Oh, still recording. Okay. I'll save the cursing until after. Tomorrow final seems kind of short to report, but he's watching us, so. Do what he says. <laughs> <laughs> Says two miles, says three miles, says report whenever he says. But yeah, he has his insight because he's already spotting uh, traffic for us. Okay. Okay. Spot all. Fifteen hundred. Yeah, you're gonna configure with all white lights. Yeah. Okay. You try to catch a glide slope. Follow the glide slope exactly down while we're high. What? You want me to drop down and get on it? Cessna 277 Golf Tango reporting two mile final. Nope, I suppose I 277 Golf Tango, Timmerman Tower, runway 15 left cleared for the option. On the go, make left close traffic. Current wind checks 1107. 15 left clear for the option, Cessna 277 Golf Tango. I suppose I should have started with the yell Timmerman Tower. Timmy Tower? Yes, ideally right. Red over white, that's when I would have started configuring because if we're following that 500 foot per minute, about you know, the airspeed is specified, that keeps us on the glide slope. So if we do it earlier, then we'll just be high the entire time and have to finesse our way through. That makes sense. I'm all about finesse. Alright, pitch for 70. Alright, 30 degree flaps. Still high. Just three five one, Mike Echo Timberman Ground. Good afternoon. Taxi to runway one five left via taxiways Alpha. Airspeed, Bravo. airspeed, airspeed. Add power. Right, got below sixty there. Right, we should be sixty five yeah, yeah, yeah. minimum. Yeah. Should be seventy until about right here. Yeah. Alright, you get way too slow and that's yeah, gonna yeah. be dangerous. Takes you five minimum, we got wins, especially crosswind. Alright. So you can pull power idle anytime now. Throttle up! Right rudder, right rudder. Full power. Rotate. The hell happened to your airspeeds there, man? I don't know. I think the. Yeah, I don't know. Yep. Pay more attention to that. Yeah. Uh, because what happens we to our airspeed when we go into a wing low side slip? It. Well, our, our stall speed or our, our stall speed increase, we've got a higher chance of stalling. Yeah, but also what we're doing is we're, you know, not being aerodynamically straight down, we're, we're going into it sideways, so we're increasing drag as well. Yeah, okay. Right, increasing drag does what to our airspeed? It slows it down. Right, so if we're already slow and we go into a wing low side slip, what's going to happen to our airspeed? It's going to go even slower. Yeah. Yep, and if you're uncoordinated, Yep, so again, if we're having crosswinds, right, we we don't want to be going below 65. Okay. Alright, 70 until short final, 65 short final. No winds, you can land around 60, 62, no issue.
the 277 Golf Tango, runway 15 left, cleared for the option. 15 left, cleared for the option, Cessna 277 Golf Tango. Alright, 9 degrees of beam, throttle 1500, 10 degree flaps. Pitch 80, pitch 80. Anything seem to be drifting out in the front? We seem to be tracking pretty good. You think we're tracking? We've been drifting a lot to the left, correct? Oh. But there's the CarMax. The old CarMax. Alright. Turn her in. 20 degree flaps. Deeper pitch down. on the slope. Yeah, it's 70 right now, right? We're not a short funnel yet. See, why am I having to add in so much, I guess, the winds are... I got 30 degrees of flaps in. A lot of drag. But usually I wouldn't put in flaps to like short funnel if we got winds. Okay. how much we need a crab, so it's going to be pretty directly related into how much wing low side slip. Yeah. I'm still going to be around 65 here if you'd like, 65 to 70. Oh. I'm Go going around. around. Yeah. I was thinking. Alright. Degrees immediately. Sixty-five. Um, Sixty-five. Positive rear climb. Good altitude. All the way up. We still need right rudder, you know. Yes. Yeah. Sounds like okay. a full deflection on the ball. <laughs> Too much correction in right away, and we just yeah. Left. Okay. But right, you know, so you just swung left. It felt like we were tracking pretty good, and then at the end, it, you're, yeah, yeah, we were tracking good in our crab. And then I, yeah, I you just went that. a little crazy on the ailerons, and as we started shooting left, you just kind of let it keep shooting until we we're on the okay. left side of the runway. I like to just add a little bit, and if it's not working, continually add more, not just try to go for a random amount. Just, you know, if this is straight again, just start here. We're still going to push, you know, continue like slowly increasing it as needed. Okay. Or vice versa, taking it out as needed.
77 Golf Tango, runway 15 left, cleared for the option. 15 left, cleared for the option, 7 Golf Tango. Alright. 90 degrees of Tower, Skyhawk 351 Mike Echo, holding short, runway 15 left, looking for departure. 351 Mike Echo, Tim Tower, hold short, 15 left, inbound traffic. Holding short, 15 left, we'll look for that traffic, 1 Mike Echo. Uh, one Mike Echo, Tim There you go, good corrections here. Are looking high or low, right? Or now. low. So, there you go, adding enough power. Very good. All right, immediate corrections. Pitch for 70 right now to help us gain some altitude as well. Good. All right, 20 degree flaps. Seventy-five knots high and not on center line. Yep. There you go. Keep the finesse coming. Be patient. Good. Wind correction. Wind correction. Wind correction. There we go. I go eight, but full part. No, that was perfect wind correction. Oh, I just felt like I was all over the runway coming in, the approach and coming in hot. So yeah, but I mean, you came in hot, but you lined up the perfect yeah, amount of wind correction. To where you stayed right down the center line. But the speed was why you were just kind of up and down, but you managed to maintain center line, which is probably kind of struggle with. So that was very well done. Three, two, don't pitch down anymore. Three, 